Here at home, the Department of Environmental Management is investigating after a small plane crashed into a pond at Burlingame State Park. Thankfully, nobody was hurt, but new this hour, we're learning more about the people on board. Eyewitness News reporter Courtney Carter joins us live in studio with the new details. A small plane crashed into the pond this evening at Burlingame State Park with two people on board. We now know the plane's owner is Mark Simmons. A man by the same name has been involved in previous plane crashes we've covered. Now this is video of the plane upside down in the pond. You can see the wheels above water here. The Department of Environmental Management told us the pilot is 26-year-old Brian Hassett and the passenger was a 16-year-old son of the owner, Mark Simmons. Now the owner wasn't on board and according to investigators, the plane crashed into the pond just before 5 o'clock and the call for help came from a Charlestown resident who lives nearby. DEM believes the plane took off from Westerly Airport and the pilot forgot to raise the plane's wheels to land. The wheels caught water while trying to land and caused the plane to flip. State officials, Charlestown Fire and Rhode Island State Police all worked together rescuing the passengers. Emergency personnel don't believe there was any major leakage of fuel but that will continue to be, to be monitored by DEM. Again, both passengers were able to get out of the plane without getting hurt. The FAA was on scene and is investigating the cause of the crash. As for the plane, we're told it's still in the water and will be pulled out tomorrow. I'm Courtney Carter, Eyewitness News.